Greetings everyone. This is Anshke Kulshres from Mah International School, Agra. Recently, I have enrolled in an online internship under Dr. Sunil Tripathi Sir related to financial literacy. In this video, I am going to summarize what I have learned in the third class of this internship. And I have prepared notes and I am going to tell from these notes. In this class, we the topic was candle and candle patterns. So what are candles? A candle is the visual representation of the size of price fluctuations in the stock market. Candle charts represent trends or reversals. Now structure of a candle. A candle has wicks and body. Upper wick represents the highest price of the share during a time period and lower wick shows the lowest price of the share during a particular time period and has a body upper points and lower points of the body shows opening or closing points now candle has four points opening point closing point highest point and lowest point now nature of the body if the closing point is higher and opening point is lower then the body represents that the nature of the body is bullish and if closing point is lower and opening point is higher then the body is bearish green body shows that people are expecting rise in the price of the share in the near future and red body shows that people are expecting the downfall in the price of the share in the near future now nature of wick if upper wick of the candle is longer as compared to the body then the wick represents bearish behavior or if the lower wick of the candle is longer as compared to the body then the wick represents that it is of bullish nature now how can we decide that what does a whole candle represents or what does a whole candle show so for this we have to combine the nature of both wick and body and whichever is dominating will be the nature of the whole candle now we have to study that what does the combination of two candles represent so if all the four points that the opening point closing point highest point and the lowest point if all these four points of a candle of a green candle are higher than the previous green candle then it is the boxing formation it is the boxing formation and repeated boxing formation represents that the stock or price is expected to be rise in the future and if all the four points of a red candle if all the four points of a red candle are lower than the previous red candle are lower than the previous red candle then it is known as reverse boxing formation and uh, if the reverse boxing formation is uh, forming repeatedly then it shows that the stock or price is expected to decrease in the near future now we have one special case that is doji formation so what is a doji formation if the body of a candle is very small or we can say that if the body of the candle is negligible then this formation is known as doji formation it shows the uncertainty in the movement of a stock or price if the doji formation is forming repeatedly then it also represents the reverse boxing formation that's all from my side for today Thank you Dr Sunil Tripathi sir for his wonderful teaching thank you again